Hey everyone, my name is Sarah and this is Hidden Agenda. Welcome back! Um, I'm really excited to jump in and eat the shit out of this game. I am really loving it. Super massive games. I am a huge fan. I am a huge fan. And it is so beautiful. It is so gorgeous visually. This game is absolutely gorgeous. And I'm very intrigued about the, the plot and the story as well. Um, in the last video, re you recall, I came to the conclusion that uh, one of the detectives was probably Adam. And I came away with it thinking, it's so obvious though. It's so obvious that maybe it's not actually the case. Is it just a red herring, you know? So I don't know anymore now. I don't know if it, if it would just be like smack right in the face like that. It seems so obvious. He was very, uh, he was very nervous about some information we were revealing, such as uh, this woman able to identify uh, a picture of Adam as a child. So uh, is this, I don't know, this witness, this, this person, could they potentially, I don't know, are they going to die? If that's the case, then very well, uh, this detective could be Adam, don't know. Um, but why else would he be nervous unless he knows Adam, he has a connection to him or something, but also we know he was at the scene of the crime. Um, he possibly laying the bombs there, the charges, uh, you know, we have footage of it. So I don't know, like it just seems so obvious though that I feel like there's got to be more to it. I don't know. But as I said, I don't know how long this game is. So um, I don't know, maybe it wouldn't be so clear if we missed clues. So I don't know. Look, let's just jump in. Let's shoot this game. I'm way too excited. Let's go. Okay, we're up to like part three now, I think. Right. I hope. Okay, that's the end of part two. Hit the box when you're ready to move on. Hit the box! <laughs> okay, uh, I thought I would quickly look at our logbook. Uh, I think we're okay with like the plot. Um... Oh wait, actually, that, this gives us a bit more detail. So what we just saw there a mysterious figure kidnapped Judge Vanstone. Is that who that was? Is that what we just saw then? Oh my god, I don't, <laughs> I don't even know. Okay, I didn't see any... Um, I'm going to have to go over that again. I didn't recognize the, the body, the person lying on the ground. Is that who that was, Judge Vanstone? Oh, wow. Okay, well, thanks, logbook. I wouldn't have known otherwise. <laughs> Look, let's just go. Let's just, just eat the shit of this game. Do we need to um, read that shit? <laughs> let's just go in unaware of what we're doing. <laughs> we have all the details. We have the hints. Oh, no. Okay, guys. Um, bit of ninja style ed editing there. Hopefully I've remembered to do it uh, because we just had to sit through some bits we've already seen. Uh, so the footage we saw of this woman doing something to that body <laughs> looked like sewing up his lips or something maybe i don't know so that is apparently judge vanstone i had a look at our logbook at the plot it says a mysterious figure kidnapped judge vanstone so that's who that was on the ground i didn't i wasn't able to identify him so without this logbook i wouldn't have known uh that's very interesting look let's continue let's jump in and you shall this game let's go and part now, three part three of hidden agenda that voice is so, um, I don't know, I feel like it breaks the immersion quite a bit. Like you're so aware you're playing a game when it comes up. <laughs> Temple bar. 13! 13 hours! What? The guy on that video, in the hoodie, same guy I chased earlier. You sure? Pretty sure. All right, so this hooker, she's working with the trapper. Why? She lures them and kills them and he sets up the trap? Uh, the thing that I'm stuck on, where did the hooker go? 
She goes into the bathroom and the hoodie guy comes out. I did some digging on Simon Hillary. What do you mean? I kind of took a peek at his personnel file. Took a what? Then I found his high school yearbook online. Becky, are you sure that's a good idea right now? Probably not. Uh, defiant. Sometimes you gotta break a few eggs. What'd you find? I found Simon Hillary. So? That's Simon Hillary. Wait, are, are you saying our Simon is not the Simon? What if he stole this guy's identity? But how? The timeline fits. They'd be about the same age. And look, you can see a resemblance. Adam supposedly died in the fire, then pretty soon after, Simon Hillary starts his training. He's been following me since the briefing. Simon? Or Adam, I guess? Yeah. So we're coming to that he conclusion? He knew I'd be looking into old cases. And that, with enough digging, they'd lead me right to him. Damn it. I'm not sure if there's enough here yet for a warrant. Uh, we can get this guy. I know, but I can get this guy. We can get this guy. With your help. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's just lay it all out first. Thanks. When Calvary was investigating the Trapper five years ago, he had one big blind spot. Prostitutes. The first target, the Undertaker. Met with a hooker the night he was killed. The second target, the orderly, arranged a meeting with a girl, an escort, the night he was killed. Father Rominski had a thing for hookers. And now Calvary is killed by a hooker. At least someone dressed like one. If it is Simon, maybe he's using a hooker to lure his targets into a premeditated murder site. Or maybe there's just... Maybe there's something we're missing. I just... Is the hookah Adam? I don't Adam. know what to think anymore. I feel like everyone is out to get me. Don't worry, detective. You're safe with me. Okay. Could the hookah be Adam? Is that possible? Could that be possible? Because, like, what, what motive does the hookah have? I don't know. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah, let's be, let's be relaxed. Yeah, why not? I'll cheers to that. Simon knew Jonathan Finn started talking, and, and then he killed Calvary because he knew everyone would immediately suspect me. Throw them mm -hmm. all right off the scent. Oh, Christ. He's been right in front of our face this whole time. What? Felicity, what? Well, a search warrant for Simon's house is out of the question. Mm -hmm. But there is another way. Like, what? he knows you, so you could call him up for a drink and- Oh, that'd be way too obvious. You've got your eyes on him. Seriously? You want to break into That's his house? That's no, well, no. Felicity He'll suspect something. Illegal, but we'd know for sure. It's illegal? What? Um, he would so suspect us, right? He knows- <sighs> He would suspect something, surely. I don't know. I feel like it's going to backfire. We'll ask him out for a drink and then he'll drug us or something. Uh, reluctant. Felicity, I think it's a trap. It'll be a... I don't think either of us should be getting in that kind of trouble. There has to be another way. My advice? Sleep on it. Take all this to Sergeant in the morning. All right. See ya. Was that us just uh, completely re rejecting the idea? Could we have gone with that idea? I just, I don't think it's a good idea. I think it would completely backfire. Uh, oh no, what? What? Oh, we're an android. We're having a short circuit. What is going on? Oh, we've been drugged. Oh, no, I think we're an android, actually. That could be it. <laughs> okay, so we were drugged. Oh, okay. Um, the lady who served us? Is she the hooker? Oh my god, I don't know. 
Hey, Lana. Check your email now. What email? 845. Oh. Wasn't it 845 when we met up? Telling argument Marty killed Calvary. Well, more than just Calvary. Play the audio. Cannot believe the mouth on this Marnie chick. We gotta be careful, or she'll blow this whole operation. What'd she say? Threatened me. Us. All of us. She's out of control. Someone's been holding on to that for years. Did you recognize the voices? No. Should I? It's been confirmed. They're two of the officers killed by the trapper. Look, Marnie's been weird, and yeah, she had motive. And? She didn't have opportunity. How do you know? She was with me the night that Calvary died. Ah. Uh, I mean, if she did it, it'd be one hell of a trick. Interesting. Okay, what's going on with Becky? Simon, like, a few steps ahead of us already. Ah, oh, loading the screen, come on. Come on! I can't wait any longer. Eight hours. Oh no. Are we the next victim? Are we being set up? Maybe we're being set up. Is there an explosive on the judge? Is that fire? Sounds like crackling of fire or something. Oh no. Oh god. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh, oh shit. What do we do? Oh, what do we do? What? 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 what does she do to me? What does she put inside me, god damn it? Uh Who is she? Hey, oh my god, no, the screen locked. Oh my she, god, my phone fucking well, who, locked. Who she? Was a, a woman, a goddamn whore. What has she done? More information, please. Hmm. How's your head, Detective Marty? Mm. I know you did it. Oh, that's such a lie. There's no escape. You're the trapper, Becky. Yeah, we could probably escape. Uh... Who are you? Why are you doing this? Simon. I know it's you, Simon. Is it? Adam. I fucking know. Impressive work. I'm almost sorry no one's gonna get to know how good of a detective you are. Oh, are we? If are we a good detective? There's a small heartbeat tracker on Judge Vanstone's wrist. Mm. It is synchronized to a cell phone that I have surgically implanted into his stomach. Mm -hmm. The phone is just a timer, but every beat of his heart knocks another second off. The faster his heart races, the quicker the clock. Now, would you care to guess what happens when the numbers reach zero? Game over. <laughs> For anyone in, say, uh, a hundred-foot radius, give or take. Which will most likely include all the police who are swarming in to arrest you right now. Sometimes killing is the only option. Mm. Interesting. You can try to run, but I can't promise you I'm not going to pop that balloon a bit early. And there's enough explosives in there to level the whole floor. Jesus Shit. Christ. So we're going to decide whether to kill the judge? Stop the heart. Stop the timer. You can't be serious. I can be whatever I want. You can be alive or you can be dead. That's your choice. And the clock's ticking. Uh, can we take the heart rate monitor off his wrist? So what did he say? Are you going to get me out of this? 
<laughs> yes, he was revealing how to disarm the bomb. Uh, we will stay, right? What did he say? Could you get me out of this, please? Does that mean we're gonna kill him though if we stay? Whoa, whoa, whoa! I did not agree to that. Did not agree to that. No, 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 no! I didn't agree to that. I said stay, I'm but so sorry about this. no, we're not shooting. Ah, uh, shit. No. No, 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 no. No, we're not shooting. <laughs> Yeah. We're not shooting. Uh, fuck. I can't. Duh. I can't do it. I can't. Oh god. Oh Can god. we figure out something to do then, Thank please? You. What are we doing? Are we just gonna sit here and wait for it to go off then? I need you. Can we just take Stay the watch off or very, something? Very calm. What? Do you understand? Why? What's happening? Oh god. Are we going to be clinical? Why in God's Shh. sake? Please, 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 just stay. Stay calm. Stay calm. I, 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 I. Oh, shit. If the timer reaches zero, then we're both dead. How much time? Take this phone out of me. It can't hurt me, right? Can you we gotta do that? get it out of me. Can we do that? We're going to operate? Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> ah, no, please. Ah, I can't take it. Ah, Have we even touched him yet? Ah, oh, wow. Ah, hey, there's no blood on us. Now what? Now what? Now what? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! We gotta take it off his wrist. What did it work? It worked? Is he okay? Is he dead? Did he die? What just happened? What, what just happened there? Okay. All right, bye. You have five missed calls. Oh, who's calling us? Call partner. Call Felicity. Felicity Graves. Becky, where are you? We need to talk. I'm being set up. I was drugged. I woke up at the Elliott Hotel. Judge Van Stone, he was rigged up by the trapper. Becky, just stay put, okay? Don't leave the building, just stay right there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's really annoying uh, sometimes when you're sitting idle with the phone, the, like, the game locks on your phone. Do you have to swipe it to open? Oh. Seven hours. Oh shit. Okay. What was that? <laughs> so could we have had an extra scene um, if we decided to go along with that idea of Felicity's? If we, because of a huge jump in time. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Becky, are you mad? Yeah. You gotta come out, Becky. Just let us bring you in. Hmm. Get sort this all out at the station. We'll just sit down, talk it through. Uh, son of a bitch. What is that gonna do? Is that gonna get a shot? We say that. Uh, okay, we're coming out. I don't know what. I don't know what saying "son of a bitch" is going to accomplish. We have to come out, right? They'll, sh they'll shoot us if we don't surrender. Shit. God 
damn it, Tom. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming out. Are we going to be stuck in a jail cell there? Hi, you've reached and Felicity Graves. Please leave a detailed message. If you're our client and this is an emergency, please hang up and dial 911. Like, if, hey, if we're stuck in jail and unable to me. complete the investigation, um, does that mean we failed? I was just calling... I was just calling to say that... What? I'm sorry, Felicity. What? I'm sorry. Bye. Oh, did we just give up? Like, we've... This means we've given up, we've failed the investigation sort of thing. We can't complete it. But maybe we should have stayed on the run. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. If we surrender, I don't know. We, we might be stuck in a jail cell. Felicity wants us to stay. Obviously it's going to look bad if we run, right? But if we surrender, are we unable to complete? We only have seven hours left, did it say? Maybe we need to flee. Let's flee. I think we might have to. No! Oh, what are we doing? Oh, where are the QTEs? Maybe we shouldn't have our gun out. Freeze! Freeze, God damn it now! We're not shooting him. Uh, I don't know if that's gonna work. I know how it looks. But I'm being set up. You have to trust me. Drop it. Drop the gun. Ah, oh, shit. I don't know. I don't know. We're making so many errors here. Flee! <laughs> we've got we've lost the gun though. Oh crap. What does that mean? We're ducking? Okay. Good on us. Alright, let's go. Run, run, run. Oh crap. Oh. Oh my god. Yes, sewers, let's go! Damn it. Damn it. I don't know. I don't know. Was that right or not? Ah. I don't know if Felicity's going to trust us now. Ah. I just I, I just feel like we're gonna waste a ton of time trying to have to explain everything down at the station. Six hours, shit. Okay, okay. Just, just deep breaths. Okay? No. No, fuck deep breaths, Felicity. I'm being set up. I know, no. Now they're gonna say I left the crime scene. Listen, I'm gonna fight in your corner, you know that. But you gotta turn yourself in, okay? Becky, it's a no-brainer, you have an alibi. Remember, you were with me the night Calvary was killed. If you run, it'll just make things worse. What did we miss? I just... I thought we could crack this thing. Did we miss too much evidence? Damn it. What did we miss? What did we... Did we miss... No! What? What does that mean? What? That's the end of the part? Becky told Felicity about her feud with Calvary. Later Felicity met her at the bar to discuss the case. Becky had a drink at the bar. She woke up in a hotel room alongside Judge Vanstone's trapped body. Becky refused to break the law to catch Simon. At the bar somebody spiked her drink. Huh. So... Mm. Could we have could we have done that? Maybe that that explains that huge jump in time. So if we had gone with the plan to 
uh, try and catch Simon that would account for those hours that we lost uh, because we instead we instead decided that we would try and find another way um, and maybe because we decided not to break the law we missed a lot of clues too shit Ah, oh my god, shit, shit, shit. Okay, um... Okay, crap. Ah, uh, now I want to go back and redo it. <laughs> oh, that Earlier sucks. today, Judge William Vanstone was kidnapped from his home on the east side of the city. He has since been rescued and is back with his family recovering. Oh, okay, he's alright. I thought he died. Marnie surrendered to police custody shortly afterwards. She has vocally denied any wrongdoing, but is considered a suspect in both the Vanstone case and the gruesome murder of Detective Jack Calvary. So we An did turn ourselves in. Ongoing. Sergeant Riggs made a brief statement to the press only moments ago. Hmm. Okay, so fleeing made no difference whatsoever. So how many hours are left then? Did we fail because we didn't decide to break and into now Simon's house? That Becky Marnie has been placed under arrest. Ah, uh, no. This time. Thank you. No, I don't we know failed. If Marnie was a trapper. I can't prove that. We failed. We failed. Shit. I know she had motive. Opportunity. Maybe. No. Oh, we failed. So I guess we I guess were supposed to break into Simon's house. <gasps> I've been asking myself that for a long time now. Crap. So what you're saying is that Marnie helped you. I'm just telling you what happened. Do you think it's possible she suffered from some form of multiple? Oh my god. <laughs> you think she was crazy? Playing both sides at once? In this town? Anything's possible. Oh, come on, dude. Becky Marnie seemed to be a troubled cop. Why did you cover for her when you had problems of your own? Back then, man, I was higher than the ISS. You know what I'm saying? The, uh, International Space Station. Can I go now? <laughs> uh, yeah, well... Marnie covered her tracks like a pro. She was <laughs> on the force, so she uh, knew exactly how we would. Oh, uh, we failed! We failed. In my uh, expert opinion, I suspect we'll never know the extent of uh, Marnie's deception. Very intelligent, manipulative, willing to take anyone down to get her way. Damn it! I'm so disappointed. I'm so disappointed. We but, failed. Hey, at least she can't hurt anyone else. Yeah, I... I don't know. I just... It just doesn't make sense. I thought she was onto something. I don't think she's behind this. I trusted her. I... I trusted her. No! Ah, uh, we fucked it. We what fucked about it. The trial? Why'd you do it, Becky? You're gonna pay for your crimes, and the public will be safer for it. <laughs> oh, it's so bad. It's so bad. We failed. Oh, we fucked. We fucked it up so bad. This game yeeted us. Oh, I'm so disappointed. I'm so disappointed. So, uh, I guess the correct course then, I just assumed that we could still get him and there was another way i didn't realize that no the correct answer is break into his house perhaps we did miss things other things along the way we know we did miss some clues i don't know how uh you know how important they were how detrimental it was to our investigation or whatever um but it seemed like this one decision whether we break the law and break it to his house or try and find another way to do things that's it that the correct decision was we should have broken into his house um <sighs> wow that's a very short game too um i'm definitely gonna want to go back and see if we can replay it i don't know if we can load individual parts um i'll see if we can uh but of course we are going to sit through the credits uh because these guys are fantastic 
and the best way to thank them or one of the best ways to thank them is to sit through the credits and let's just give them a little round of applause yeah <laughs> these guys are incredible i love their games i really do and i can't wait to see uh house of ashes is coming out very soon i can't wait to see that from the dark pictures anthology I'm going to pick that up as soon as it comes out. I cannot wait, cannot wait. But this, I am not satisfied with what's happened. Obviously, we need to fix this. We need to fix this. So if you are willing, please hang around to the end of the credits. And let's see if we can redo this, okay? <laughs>
Whoa. You have <gasps> some of a rat problem. Oh my god. It was him. Ah. <laughs> oh, I'm glad we got an after credit scene. So we're back, obviously. Thank you so much for sticking around. I really do appreciate it. Uh, so I don't know if we can jump in and pick up uh, in a particular part. Can we do that? Okay, guys. So I've just had a quick look online and I've had a quick look around here too. Uh, it seems we cannot replay parts. Uh, which makes no sense to me. It makes no sense to me. So if we want to replay this and try and get, uh, you know, the, the correct or the right ending, we have to replay this whole game. It looks like that. It looks like that. So uh, I am, I'm quite disappointed, uh, you know, because I really just wanted to replay that, replay that last part and, uh, you know, go and break into Simon's house, which apparently is the correct choice. If we do any other thing, then that's wrong and we're not going to get the good ending, or what I assume is a good ending. But I did have a think. I was wondering, um, you know, so while we go break into the house, uh, Simon or the hooker at the very least, you know, has Judge Vanstone uh, kidnapped and they've placed a bomb on him and everything. So our alibi, uh, because they suspect uh, Becky, don't they? They suspect Becky of being the trapper. Um, our alibi is going to be, oh, we were breaking into a house. <laughs> is that what it's going to be? I don't know. Uh, I'm so disappointed, guys. I'm really disappointed. We can't replay. Please hit me up in the comments, though, if you want me to start a new game and try and get the good ending. Uh, well, well, I assume is the good ending if we break into the house. Let me know, too, if there are other decisions that we should make or change. Uh, if we missed any vital clues. Uh, that you know have led us to this bad ending do we need to make sure we pick those up if we do replay please hit me up in the comments i am so disappointed i am so disappointed i was sure that we could go and replay a chapter apart um that sucks it really sucks because that ending was shit that ending was shit of course um it makes absolutely no sense surely there was enough evidence and what becky's just accepted it she had no words to say during her interview they think she's the trap of fuck's sake and she's like, oh, well, you know, the player fucked up, so what could I do? I'm stuck in jail, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. And then, obviously, Finn was released because Becky was apparently the trapper the entire time. They weren't working in coots or anything. It's just, no, Be Becky's the, obviously the trapper. Um, you know, like, surely she had al alibis for other killings that occurred in the past too when it was originally thought it was Finn he also you know uh he also uh said he was the traffic killer so <laughs> I don't know I feel like there were way too many holes there uh for them to just blindly accept that oh it was Becky you know she did have an alibi for at least one of the recent killings uh but I guess what that doesn't stick or anything so I feel very unfulfilled I feel very unsatisfied uh, with how that went that I feel like there were way too many holes uh, in that for them to just accept that it was Becky you know I don't think there's enough evidence to suggest that it was her um, and yeah very disappointed that we uh, I don't know we couldn't find another way to capture Simon uh, who is actually Adam I guess uh, so I thought that was way too easy I thought that was just too easy it was like right in your face um, but, oh wow, that is, that's disappointing, that's disappointing. But please hit me in the comments. I feel like I I gotta replay it to get the right ending. Um, but let me know, let me know if you think I should give it another go or just maybe have a break for now and come back to it later. <sighs> oh yeah, that's, that's disappointing. That's disappointing. Supermassive Games, missed opportunity there. I don't know why they couldn't let you uh, replay chapters. I know it's a shorter game, but I don't think most people would want to replay the entire thing just to make one decision change in a final part or in just one part. That's very uh, disappointing. You know, I thought it would be like until dawn where you can just jump into a chapter as you please. And I think that I think it was the same for like Dark Pictures Anthology. I think you could jump into chapters too, if I'm not mistaken. Still, oh, wow, wow. 
But look, thank you so much for joining me, uh, for sitting through all those credits in anticipation of uh, me picking up and playing again. I'm very sorry about that. Uh, that is a shame. That is a real shame. Oh, but you know what? Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I just want to give a shout out to my lovely patrons. Thank you guys so much for your support. It means the world to me. It really does. And if you'd like to become a patron yourself, please check out the link in the description below. If you like this video, please do like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. It really helps me out. It really does make a difference. I'll catch you guys in the next one. But please do let me know in the comments if you want me to replay this. Um, or if there is a way to replay a chapter. I can't find it. I can't find it. And I had a quick look online. It looks like there is no, uh, no opportunity to do that. That's a shame. That's a shame. But yeah. Let me know. Until then, I will take a break, I guess, and pick up with something else. I've got something else in mind. And uh, I hope you enjoy it. But until then, please do have an amazing day, slash night, slash whatever, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye.